Hi, I'm Josh from Fugo, and in this video, I'll be talking all about our favorite digital signage players at the low, mid-range, and high-end price points. So let's start at the lower end of the price range. There are some great plug-and-play devices under $200 that will let you create smart digital signage display on a budget. They're good options if you just need to set up a couple of screens in your store or office and want to play relatively simple content without multiple zones or layered elements like text or animations over video. The Amazon Fire TV Stick 4K is a beginner-friendly device and hands down one of the easiest ways to start a project with Fugo. It's cheap, at around $50, and its stick form factor makes it easy to attach to the back or side of your TV. It connects via the HDMI port found on most consumer TVs and can handle 4K video output. It supports internet connections via Wi-Fi or Ethernet adapter, and if you're using Fugo as your management software, can display in portrait mode in addition to landscape. Next up is the Xiaomi Mi Box S, which is also available for around $50 and runs on Google's Android TV OS. It may be a better option for users in countries where the Fire Stick isn't available. It's similar to the Fire Stick in performance and ease of setup and shares some of the same disadvantages. It has low storage space, isn't available to buy in bulk, and because it's not a business ready device, is not meant to run for long operational hours. So when it comes to the mid-range players, there are many options in the $200 to $400 range that offer good performance and more business-ready features, like multi-zone layout support, smooth playback, and the ability to run Fugo in kiosk mode. One of our absolute favorite devices in this range is the Nvidia Shield TV. It comes in two models, Standard and Pro, priced at $150 and $200 respectively. Both can handle almost any rich content you throw at it. Animations, scrolling ticker feeds, multiple zone layouts, and 4K video. It runs on Android TV OS, which is always up to date and secure. This is not a professional digital signage media player. So if you're running it 24 seven or over eight hours a day, its lifespan will be shorter than what you would get with something like the Intel Nook or a commercial Chromebox. Next up, the Asus Chromebox 4. At just under $300, this player provides sufficient processing power with an excellent overall experience. It doesn't break a sweat rendering animations, HTML5 video, and complex content created in Fugo's native design studio. Once your accounts and licenses are squared away, deployment is easy, and single app kiosk mode, which is good for securing your public display, is set up by default. The main drawback with the Chromebox is that users are required to purchase an additional $50 Chrome license for each device in your network and enroll them in the Chrome Enterprise Device Management. So now we've come to our final category, performance players, priced at $400 and above. They are best suited for businesses looking to invest in players that can power large-scale networks with significant demands on their hardware. The A Open Chromebox Commercial 2 is one of the top solutions for just this case. Unlike the standard Chromebox mentioned before, it was designed to operate 24 seven without hiccups or significant wear and tear. This player is also extremely powerful, able to stream 4K video seamlessly and with dual output, it can power up to two displays at once. Despite being a commercial device, it shares the same advantage as all Chrome based players in its ease of use. There's no steep learning curve, so you can jump right in, and the web-based management console makes it easy to administer your organization's Chromebox fleet. And now we've come to the final player in our list, the Intel Nook Mini PC. Although significantly pricier than the other options on this list, it also packs way more of a punch when it comes to processing power, which makes it perfect for any use case, including video wall installations with multiple displays in 4K. This line of players includes a handful of models which come with fast Wi-Fi or Ethernet and connect via HDMI port. It supports a wide range of business apps and systems, allowing you to run other apps alongside Fugo. The downside of these higher end players is obviously the price point. Unless your use case demands the best of the best, you can get slightly less powerful players made by both manufacturers that will get the job done with relative ease. Thanks so much for watching and make sure to get in touch with our team to speak about your project needs.